Hey, what's up YouTube fam? Brandon Weaver here once again. That's right, $30,000 worth of medical collections deleted. I'm gonna talk to you about that review and testimonial right now. We've also got, yes, some people trying to play games, the Bureau's trying to play games again, and we're gonna talk about this and what you can do about it, okay? So, happy holidays to you, Brandon. Thank you very much. Happy holidays to you and all of you out there. Holidays are coming up. It's a great time to dispute with the Bureau's. You know that. We've talked about that. You, you can get to the other side, all right? And hit that subscribe, try button, and that bell for notifications if you're not part of our tribe yet, all right? Really appreciate you. Now, thank you for your 609 credit repair lettuce, okay? The HIPAA letter, specifically the HIPAA letter, which is uh, in addition to for these medical collections on top of your 609 disputes, on top of your collection validation letters, send in your HIPAA letters, right, if they violate your HIPAA rights, uh, in our Beyond Committed package, which you can get at 609creditrepair.com and get the Beyond Committed package, got the HIPAA letters. The HIPAA letters saved me $30,000 in hospital collections, okay? I sent the letter and it was removed from my credit reports. This is fantastic. This individual is getting to the other side, helps them, helps their family. This is fantastic. This is phenomenal stuff. Now, I had another individual who wrote in, and they're talking about the credit bureaus playing this game again. They're trying to stall. Check this out, okay? Let me know what to do, Brandon. I sent off round one of the 609 dispute letters, and one of the bureaus came back, and they said, oh, well, we need to verify your identity, right? They'll do this type of stuff. Oh, well, we can't read what you said. It's illegible. You put all your good information on there, okay? Who you are, your ID, social, utility bill, whatever it is that you have to do, even notarize. Sometimes you're notarizing these letters, right? Get them notarized for this type of reason because they try to pull this nonsense. So we've got the stall tactic letter right here for you. I'm upset that you would try such a blatant stall tactic. I'm demanding you reinvestigate my credit file on the Fair Credit Reporting Act Section 611. Okay, and you can send them a copy of what you sent in with the highlighted disputes from the past, right? From the first round, you can show them. You can show them the nonsense they're trying to pull. And if they continue this type of salt tax, you can complain CFPB, BBB, and all this great stuff available to you, okay? You can do this. You can get to the other side, 609creditpair.com, get the Beyond Committed package, or we can do the work for you at the awesomelifegroup.com. Please give the video a thumbs up, hit the subscribe, try button, and until I see you in person, I will see you on the other side. Take care.